Here we are, hardcore crappie fishing. These are the crappie fishing pros and guides here on uh, Beaver Lake. And uh, very respectable, honest people and Facebook people. They love Facebook. Don't yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we're here to help you decide what is true on Facebook and what is false on oh, Facebook. Oh, yeah. Right? Yeah, Facebook drama. Oh, oh Facebook man. drama. So, <laughs> My favorite. So we're, we're trying not to get Peyton to have all the time. So hopefully someone else can get in there sideways. Yeah. And slip in. But, but things you should know is, first of all, fishing reports. Fishing reports, when you see them on Facebook. So when you see a Facebook post on mine, uh, about crappie fishing, it's possible that they were caught at a different time or a different location. And some of that is because I use the stuff that I get for social media for yeah. Mitch's stuff. So I don't want to take, I catch a good crappie, like when I caught my personal best, I didn't post it until two a few weeks, later. yeah, two or three days later. But I did that because I was posting it to Mitch's page, so the right. Pico page. So that's just, it's, I'm, I never say I caught that this day. If I say I caught it this day, then I caught it this day, mm -hmm. the day of the post. But if I don't, it, it may be a post from, from prior from that week or a couple weeks, you know, in there. It's, yeah. it's hard telling. But tell us, tell us, like, when you post to Facebook, Peyton, is it? Is that kind of the same way, or do you usually I'm pretty, post I'm pretty same truthful of the day. I post by the day, and I'm truthful oh. about what I catch them on and stuff. Um, my background pictures, I you know, the last couple of years, I've really had to be careful with that. Because, uh -huh. I mean, you'll, next morning, there's three boats there. Right. You know. And it got funny, because I purposely made a post, like, by, you know, a recognizable spot. Yeah. <laughs> and there was fish there, and I, I didn't even there. fish that area. One guy's like, "Man, I caught him right here, Bubba." <laughs> You're like, oh, I, I like, should have went there. But it actually worked out because I went there the next day, and I, you know, I caught him too. So, but yeah, I mean, you know, w w the fish can't hide now. Yeah, I yeah. mean, if you look for them hard enough, you'll find them. And on most so, of the mom, but I the main the main thing is is that you know other guides do want to feed off your success, so right. you do have to watch that. How about you? You well, post uh, a lot of mine. Consistent. I'll post, you know, that day. And uh, but if you'll notice and get to watching in my post, ninety percent of my pictures are at the boat ramp. Right. Very, I very rarely, uh, and it's my bad because uh, I mean, my sponsors are wanting pictures of us in action, of course, right. with the men that lured, and I, I just. It just slips my mind because I'm real bad about not taking pictures on the on the water. Because you're thinking about and, fishing. Well, yeah, Catch yeah. It. It's yeah. not because I'm worried about anybody right. finding where I'm at or the background. It's just I'm concentrating on what I'm doing, and it's just uh, and when I get in, I I usually post most of my pictures are taken there at the ramp unless. Unless somebody, once in a while, you uh, have somebody uh, that'll catch a really good fish or something. Right. And, but very, there's very little background. If I take a picture and it's in the boat, it's, you, you, you won't recognize where I'm at very often. Not, not, not too often will you see, uh, you might see water, but you're not going to see yeah. the bank or be able to determine where I'm at. And, uh. I'm, I'm just not, and I mean, I go places and I people have big stringer photos and stuff, and oh, I'm just not into that. that you don't even tell to us. Stuff. We're your friends. We're like, hey, you're, you, we have <laughs> on you all the time. We're like, oh. <laughs> I tell you approximately where I am. <laughs> <laughs> six months ago. That's right. I found another six months ago. Uh, yeah. There ain't nobody hey, calls anybody more than uh, that guy right there. So, so the big stringer photos, like, like, they don't appeal to me as much as... Even though, yeah, because you don't like my photos. <laughs> the big, the big stringer photos and stuff. They, I want to see the person's face, right? Or I, I want to see like right. something. I'm looking more artistic, I guess I should say, compared to, you know, I could well, lay them out. I could lay them out and take the picture, but then that's not something I can use for everyone else. Right. Mm -hmm. And also, comments. though, you with uh, you being in the, more the. Uh, Photography, media yeah. stuff. You you're looking at a different direction of a picture 
yeah. than what we do. Right. Yeah, I mean, like, uh, like a picture with Peyton on the Mayfly, yeah. uh, the Mayfly hatch. I, I didn't want a whole bunch. I wanted Peyton's face so they could see who he is. Right. right. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, I mean, that's what it is. But, but you like the big stringer photo. Yeah. You're yeah. the... The, he's like famous for the the stringer. Yeah. yeah, he brought the stringer photos back. In fact, they yeah, and then uh, he did he brought it back. He did. I mean, uh, people you, saw that with all them slabs on it. I can't tell you how many. Man. I can't tell you how many people though that <laughs> that I know and and we, I go he fishing so with jealous. him. I go fishing with him, and then we hold up these fish on our fingers. You know, <laughs> you guys are taking the same daggone fish every time you get. I said, how are we taking the same fish? I, I'm only with him. <laughs> Half a yeah. dozen times yeah. a year, and, and this guy's got these fish all the time. I said, it's, I mean, it's actually taken. It's just, yeah. you know, and that sort of thing. But we always do it at the ramp. Yeah. 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 Or, or and whatever. Have you seen which ramp he's at? And, uh, well, I'm, uh, yeah. yeah, when I'm with my, when I take people out, it's that's at the ramp. I mean, it's the same thing. If, I, if they catch a good fish, you know, I'll take it at the water. I don't I'm kind of good. Well, I don't pay. I need to pay attention. I don't know. I don't. Have, I don't really worry about. Yeah. I ain't got that issue yet. Now I took he's only fishing. he's only trained about fifteen guides that are fishing. You know. So I, right. I just I just I just, <laughs> I just think, I don't. I mean I don't know. I just I look at the background. Well, that house is in there. I better get that out of the way. So, but but I don't. I don't, I don't really pay attention. I don't really worry about it. I mean, when I'm out there, I don't worry about. What I mean, we else all we all. Right. Yeah. 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 But we all post. We all still post quite a bit, but most of I don't think any of us three or four, rather, I don't think any of us post as much as what we used to. I mean, it's, no, it's I just, post for other people, and so literally, yeah. I get like, I, I get really lackadaisical on mine. Yeah, and that's the reason why, I like Pico, I use I mean, Pico I because I made that post and that one. I made a post the other day, or uh, like here lately, I've been making my post, but I just make it on my page mm -hmm. and my guide page yeah, and my personal right. page. I haven't been tagging it to, to uh, B &M or someone. You know mm -hmm. the uh, the other fishing guide pages oh. or yeah. any of the Northwest Arkansas. I don't know. I just kind of gotten away yeah. from doing that. I'll put from time to time. I'll send it to Bobby Garland's page or right, yeah. B&M's page or something like that because they, they like for us to do that. And you actually do a fishing report. Like yeah, every, every Friday, right? right? So what, that's yeah. Every, so, I, you know, every trip I do, every week I have a trip, I, I do my, that's my accurate catch, you know. Uh -huh. But like every Friday, I try to do it every Friday morning. I try to post up how. What time do you get up in the morning to type all that? Up? I pre write it. I mean, I, I pre write to, it. You do? I pre write it. I, re I pre write it like on Wednesday and I post it up on Friday. I'm going to say, I'd have to. But yeah, start sometimes it gets long. No, he gets up early. I, I get some time rest. into it. I mean, he texts me at 4 a.m. I'm up. But, but I pre write it and I'll usually use a previous picture from like a year or two ago because, I mean, I don't know. That, that's, that, that picture's not like a week of picture. Not right. the week of like recent catch. <laughs> That's just a a picture from right. last yeah. year. Last year, I think, yeah. or six months ago. But right. kind of but that. like what? But every week when I'm going fishing, that's my accurate catch. But then I do a previous report of what how that went bite went that week. But if I tell, and I them, keep it honest. I mean, I'm, if, I'm telling yeah, you, I'm I mean, smoking them. If I'm at uh, regardless whether I'm on the ramp or whether somebody sends me a comment right on you know, what What about catching these fish and, and stuff. Well, for example, I had a guy text me last night, uh, he texted me, and uh, he said, man, what's, what's, what's your thoughts? He said, uh, I've been trolling three or four times. He said, I noticed when you've been, you, you posted just Saturday where you caught, you know, you had almost a limit. And he said, I haven't caught a limit yet. Right. And he said, what, what, what's going on? And, um, and I, I told him what I thought. I mean, I told him, he asked me for I, what I was fishing. I, I told him the type of water I was fishing. I didn't say where I was fishing. Right. And I, a lot of times I'll do that. I'll be as honest as I can yeah. be. I may not tell you exactly where I'm fishing, 
But if I tell you I'm fishing 20 to 25 foot of water and I'm catching them roughly this depth uh, deep and I'm pulling at this speed or I'm using this jig, or, uh, that's all gospel truth. Yeah. And, uh, but then he was asking uh, why it seemed a little tougher uh, like trolling this year and yeah. that's when I was telling him I think a lot of it was the thermal climb's not stable, it's it's not solid all the way across the lake at this oh, point to, you know, the yeah. lake's not stable or the, the weather's lake. not stable and, you know, people don't think about those. Right, so, Cause they, and they only have an opportunity to fish Saturday and Sunday. Yeah. So and, they're taking those those snippets that they get and they're trying to put it together. And, yeah. But if you've been out there and doing it, you've you've kind of figured out where that where that is. But like most guides that are good guides, you change on the fly. Yeah. Like all of a sudden, like I do that a lot right. when I'm pulling crankbaits. I'll be like, whoop. Nope. Yeah, you look at Didn't get a bite in five minutes? Ah, mm -hmm. I will not. Like, yeah. I'll just keep going. I mean, and you look at the top of my console right now, and there's 15 or 20 different crank baits piled up there. Yeah. You're changing them out. Again. The lo location is, is, it's not the most important thing. The most important thing is getting to where that water's right. Yeah. The, lo the location of, there's multiple places that are the same, like, where you're fishing, there's multiple places, there's multiple boat docks on this lake. Yeah. There's multiple flats that are on this lake. You know, there's right. multiple places where you can Sounds go and pull. And yeah, and everything else. Exactly. So if you can apply that to what what a person's talking about in depth and stuff, that's how you should apply it. Don't don't just because they're going on a four twelve you know, a lot of times or go ramp. That, yeah. That person's out of War Eagle Ramp, and so you, you use those fishing reports to s try and get down to what is important for you to catch fish. And so, so color, color is important, but if you have the right color on, but you're fishing the flats and you're catching catfish, well, then maybe you should be in deep water. Right. Using uh, like a purple splatterback or something, you know, a pink color or something. You need. Not to not to use that. Now, my pet peeve. Everyone gets a pet peeve. My pet peeve is people that start Facebook pages and say that this is a community page when it just actually just turns out to be a guide's and, page. Yeah, a guide's right. page. Yeah, and they post it, and no other guides post on that page. Yeah, right. And so it's like, <coughs> like, and if you were to post a <coughs> post on that page, then. Like it doesn't show up, or yeah, right. or you know, it's it's not. And that's not like the same way. If one of us happens to ask somebody, hey, what would you do to catch those? You know, whether it be on Facebook, I get lied to. Yeah, they're like, you know, <laughs> they don't want to tell me nothing. I mean, you're like, you know, well, you're God. Why should I tell you? You know, well, I mean, I'm just, I don't expect you to tell me. Right. I didn't ask you where you caught them. I asked you what you did to catch them. Right. You know. What, yeah. What's your pet peeve? Probably about the same thing you're oh, talking about thing. on the pet peeve part. I just, I mean, what is, the biggest thing on there is, like you said, the other guys, it's not necessarily the, just the one posting on that particular page, but it's interesting to me that we do have pages of throughout Northwest, mostly Northwest Arkansas, but there's like five different, four or five different pages, and you can post at like three years, two and three years ago, I could make a post on there, and I would get tons of comments right. and information, and people asking me information, and and then now, you, if you did post on there, it's like you're nobody. You know, you yeah. just, I'm just like, it's almost like, why do I even mess with Facebook anymore? I right. mean, that's, that's my biggest thing. I mean, if you're going to go in there and you're going to be the person and you're going to put your stuff out there, you're going to get questions, you're going to get asked, you're going to get this. Right. Yeah. I mean, be, be honest, be truthful and tell your deal. Don't, I mean, it's just, it's just crazy. And uh, 
you know, you expect me to be honest. So, yeah. have a who. Yeah. Well, I expect you to be honest with me if I make a comment or whatever. But it's just, it, it, there's so much of that anymore. You can even make a, try to make a, uh, an honest comment, but it's, you're not really running anybody down. You're not really downgrading anybody, but then you get slammed, you know, and I'm like, forget it. No one, yeah. no one has probably had more comments on Facebook than Peyton. That's <laughs> true. And I, I'm saying that nicely because of the incident at the boat dock. Yeah. And so there was a lot of interaction between, yeah. and it was, it was very positive interaction. Yeah. Uh, they were they were able to tell angles. Ninety percent of it was positive. Yeah. Well, I mean, there's, there's always there's always <clears throat> a few, but but I mean, so in actuality, we're that that actually helps you, right? Talk to yeah, people. Yeah. To a degree. And, yeah. Market. Yeah. And so, do you ever still get a like a post? All like, the time. I, I get like a couple time. guys. They're like, were you like us like shooting boat dock steak? Fish Tim's dock. Like, <laughs> I, I haven't heard like from that person that doesn't comment yeah. or like nothing in like a year. year and like that's all they'll say. That's all they'll and say. They, and then they're gone again. Well, they're not they're on just there get in there. Just, no, just, no. Just, they don't follow you enough to know the anything no. else. No, oh, but that's funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah that's funny. funny. <laughs> That'd make my day if someone if someone said that. They always I just laugh and go on, but yeah, I fished a fire out of it. And then I get people to comment and go. There ain't nothing on Tim's dock anymore. <laughs> right. <laughs> where did where where did that ambush stick go? Yeah. Grab that ambush stick. You know, there's a new dock around there now. Is there? Yeah, yeah. new dock. Let's yeah. go try it. I was walking. Get back into the. Dock. You're getting lots of comments on uh, on your. You're getting some comments on your Friday post. Your yeah. real long yeah. post. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I get it's all positive feedback. Yeah, I, mean, I try to most keep, part. I try I try to keep all my stuff positive and Yeah, and everybody likes slants. He doesn't I, really have any haters. I don't I guess. I I, no I, I, I avoid drama. Yeah, he I does, avoid, yeah. I avoid drama. I just That just means he if you post on his he don't like it, he just deletes you. <laughs> like, <laughs> like delete, delete, you know, delete. Just, he just, just goes goes over. I just, I just do my own block, thing. Block. I don't I just do my own thing and I just you know, well if you, there's Tom over there fishing and Okay, just keep on going. I don't, I don't. I just Half don't the time, I don't even know. If somebody comes by me, or even on the lake and hollers, I can't yeah. tell you who it is. Yeah. I ask him all the time. Who is that? But I just try to keep social media positive. I just, yeah. And I just, right. you know, that's it. So those, uh, any tips for posting on Facebook? <laughs> any yeah, tips? Wrong guy. I mean, I could post something about it being beautiful outside and somebody would comment and be like, what, what weather are you looking at? You know, or you know, something negative. They're, they're always after me. How about, how about you, Greg? Are you You're more like a grandpa to everyone, Greg. I'm sure everyone I'll say it's a here. beautiful day. If somebody come out, how do you know what kind of day it is? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> to the degree, I'm, yeah, I'm just like, I'll just delete it going. <laughs> to, to a degree, I'm a lot like Lance. To a degree, I try to stay clear of everything. But I will say, if somebody comments, and I don't appreciate that comment on that they made, or I to feel that it's inappropriate, uh -huh. I will message that person, and I will ask them to remove it, and I will tell them why. Yeah. And I expect them to be person enough to respond back in the private message, and most of the time, in any other deal, we're on the same good note and we're fine. Oh, I've gotten better though. You've gotten yeah. better. Yeah. Right. You know, I, I, I have gotten comments where I have my fish on the table. <laughs> yeah. Right. I have my fish on the table. I've had comments where some of the I thought it had to be a ten inch length. Yeah. Length. Yeah. And I had to. I'll, you know, I know game of fish watches. Yeah. Actually, I have a ruler on my cleaning table. Yeah. Yeah, the tail's hanging off with 16 inches. You know, I mean, it's just like that I got big fish, and, they and don't then you got see. these little fish back here. They're going to look like tiny fish compared to a 14 And they don't see stock. and realize we get checked, too. You know, and I, I tell my them. Favorite, my favorite, did you leave any for seed? Yeah. 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 And then yeah. I, I'm like, they'll come right up to me when I'm cleaning fish at the truck in front of customers. Huh, looks like uh, you got all the crappie out of the lake. 
Why don't you yeah. save some of the rest of us? I'm like, you can see how many we turned back. Or how many didn't bite. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, or all right. of these. I tell you, man. You're getting oh, ramped up. We got another 10 minutes. Time. So you want to, yeah. you got anything else? Man. You want to get off your chest? Like, <laughs> Oh, it's interesting. No, it's... All they got it's like a comment is come and go, I want you to take me fishing and I you know, I had one guy do that once. He what? he just he bashed me all the time on Facebook and then he's like, You know what, I can't take you anymore, I need to go with you. And then it was just a one eighty to one eighty. He's like, You're right, look at all these fish. I mean it just and that is nice nice to me. Yeah. So I took his money but he's nice to me, you know. That's right. But it's just yeah. like, you know, Interesting life we live. Oh, it's right. it's it's comical. I mean, my wife, I could be sitting on the couch and she knows if I'm in some drama or not by a facial expression. <laughs> you know, she's like, who are you commenting to? <laughs> oh, she's trying to see you guys. <laughs> yeah. That happens. She your butt that happens. She's your butt. Yeah. Is what Tiffany, are you saying? Because you got that look. Is Tiffany your bumper? Yeah. Like, does she does she go like, oh, uh, no. Yeah. Like, no, 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 no. Uh, that no, is, don't don't uh, start. Don't even give them the time of day. Let them attack. That is the truth. Because that happened today. <laughs> I've seen it. I've heard it. She does it all the time. Because <laughs> people, they'll, they'll put on my tax every page. The P the people get on there and they'll just, oh, oh, yeah. oh man, it just turns me sideways. Yeah. <laughs> Keep it positive. That's yeah. my goal. Keep go. it positive. And if <laughs> someone comes and just uh, is, avoid the drama. That's yeah, I'm having right. more loud. I, I, I'm yeah. bitter about now just going block or delete. Oh, then yeah. I never there get to go. see my fish again. So joke's on them. And the real trick is to make you like and subscribe on yeah. because. <laughs> Because we try and, and put your comments in there. Yeah, put your comments. <laughs> and, uh, oh, now they'll be hey. commenting on this. Hey, yeah, yeah, make sure you comment. <laughs> that dude right there. He he wants some. Bring him. Bring him hard. I want to. I want to see. I mean, someone needs to 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 post any fish under that dock. <laughs> we got to see one of those. I love to see Grippy go along and like 30 people. And you fish there? Where's Tim? Where's Tim? Where's Tim? I saw Tim. Where's Tim? Where's Tim? Okay, That'd we're going to do awesome. a podcast on Tim's dock. Yeah. <laughs> we're there on you Tim, go. Tim's dock today. Make sure you like, subscribe. <laughs> hey, if you want to sponsor the show, you can. There's always open <laughs> for sponsorships. And we'll drop your name. We'll be a name dropper. Yeah. We're not. We're not we're not opposed to doing that. We have good sponsors, and we're always looking for more sponsors. Yep, right. So, uh, Lance, if they want to get hold of you, or maybe uh, if uh, you're not on Facebook, how would they call you? They can call me at 479-236-4105. What's your Facebook? Uh, Lance Huey, Crappie Guide Service, or you can just look me up, Lance Huey. You can uh, look under uh, Wheatman's Guide Service, or you can call uh, me at 479-756-5279. And Greg's Guide Service or 479-601-1683. Hey. If you want to laugh all day, you can find me at Peyton Usher Fishing or call me at 479-387-6153. There you go. Let's go hardcore on rumors. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>